Before I start this video I want to thank you for watching. Please don't forget to share it with your friends. And with that being said. In Elvenar you can either play the human race or the elven race. The races have completely different looks, but the gameplay is pretty similar, so don't be too afraid to pick your choice. At the beginning, buildings are constructed in no time, but they are also rather simple and basic. Over time, by unlocking new technologies, you can upgrade your buildings step by step to become more advanced and sophisticated. If you need a break from building your city, go onto the world map to visit other players, scout your environment and take a look into all kinds of mysterious provinces filled with friends and foes, challenges and rewards. Everything you do on the world map will help your town to develop, to grow and to become even more beautiful. The world of Elvenar inhabits two different races. The elves are a very sophisticated folk. They live in harmony with nature rather than superseding it. On the other hand, we've got the humans. The human buildings have a strong European medieval fantasy look. They are defined by the craftsmanship relying on stone and metal. Let's take a look at the elven residence, for example, and see how some of the architectural differences show in the game. The most striking element of this building is the tree. A human architect might have cut it down, made plants out of it and used them to construct the building. The humans use a lot of processed materials for this building. Forged metal for the roof and the brick-built walls emphasize their architecture. All right, thanks for watching and of course listening. And if you want more information, go to elvenar.com and I guess we'll see each other soon.